okay, let's continue on. Um, I did a little bit of cleaning up while, you know, I was doing it. And, um, pull him up. Anyway, and then I had a problem. I accidentally created something I had to go uncreate. Um, what I did was I kind of cleaned this up a little bit, this green, and I made the current week um, read only, and I manually entered the tab stops in here. And the next thing we're going to do is um, I want to default these employee and week number ranges so that someone doesn't have to key them. They can just take the default if they want to and on the old one I had put those in the load but I think I'm going to put it in um, when the tab in just changes because you know it could be week to week and the way you know I do it we have the current week and then normally when people do payroll they do it for the previous two weeks you know like here it is Monday you're working on payroll on Monday or payroll clerk is but he's not working on it for that week he's working it for the last two weeks and so that we started with the beginning week and then we got the the ending week and we started with the beginning employee 1000 and the ending and they can they can change those this just defaults so they don't have to people just do not like to do any more can than uh, they have to do like we'll show you see now it defaults for you and um, then I changed the header. I hadn't looked at this. I guess we can look at it now. We can do a print. I don't know if it'll print. Let's see if I've got an error or something in here. Now, yesterday, whenever it pulled up the PDF or the other day, that's what zapped out my PC. Something about the lighting or something when it went to um, Microsoft. Um, I These are AVI files, and I convert them to Windows Media Player because they're smaller and they take less time to load and that kind of went it berserk and that's the reason I've got that one little 57 second one from last week anyway we'll see and then the header he should have the dates and stuff on him now which this I hadn't looked at it yet we'll look at it together and uh, right now I don't have a page counter but I'm going to put a you know page counter when we get that far and uh, it's about to create my document and we did some error checking and I'm going to take to the code okay it's got the week number I don't guess oh I don't think I did the date stuff yet so we'll we might work on the date to convert the date and we're going to exit and I did do some error checking on the print report portion like yeah we didn't do the the date yet but we will I did these um, an error checking routine to make sure things was numeric. When they press the print button, um, you know I have to make sure that the week and employees integer. Like if I had gone and hand keyed in something wrong, it would have sent me out, you know, error messages. And I'll go ahead and show the rest of it. And then we printed the report. And the only thing we did on this report is I uncommented these two header lines and um, begin week text box dot text. Well, I'm going to come over here to my other program and see um, what I did there. Edit, fine. Begin. Let's see. Begin week text. Okay, we already did that. But what is begin week begin date? Excuse me. Let's that's the different program. Begin date. Okay, we did that at the okay that's one thing that we didn't do I should have done that this here before we do the header was the routine uh, we're just gonna do the fake portion the extract file we hadn't got even started on that yet so we're not gonna worry about that yet and um, this was when we actually printed paste okay now let's see if it'll give us our dates. Yeah, 
that's how I want to replace. Okay, I got my dates for the last previous two weeks up until last Friday. And in fact, you know, they are the right weeks because this is the stuff we use at my work. Anyway, we're going to call this a lesson and we'll do some more. This gets pretty complicated because we have to do control breaks and um, we're going to create an extract file too. And uh, you're going to find uh, when you have a regular job, m the bulk of your programming is going to be reports. Um, so, anyway, you guys, happy programming. Bye.